Hey guys, welcome back to Factorio. This is Eddie Man, episode number 64. The last episode we went ahead and we got our mission critical um, series plot or arc up and rolling. Um, here we are in not point 17, but we're still playing like we're in not point 16. Remember that, guys. Um, last time we did a major biter pushback of both our western side, northern side, and of course our eastern side. Now the biters did encroach back in. Um, they're pain in the butts, but I did gain this space here. And as you can see, I started building defense walls. Um, these two iron mines are going to be um, our next course of action here uh, for our one last iron fix for this series on camera that is at least um, and I ran out of supplies to build to continue building this western part of it but um, I'm gonna slowly gonna go ahead and do that and of course I'll continue that off camera but today let's go ahead and create these two mines and I need to build some defense down here so these biters don't encroach through the forest to destroy this little miner here. Okay, so let's go ahead and proceed with that. So what I think I'm going to do is run two red belt um, from this air little area here of iron ore back to the train station. I know it's a long way, um, but I don't feel like um, I feel like being lazy and not worry about the trains anymore. Uh, they do suck up a lot of your time. Um, so, we're just going to blow all these up here. This is so much easier. Okay. Should be good. Clear, clear the area of trees. And I might as well just get rid of this patch there. Okay. And we'll clean up just a little bit. Ah, see, they did expand over here. Since I last went ahead and cleaned the area up, of course they did. Because why wouldn't they? I mean, they're programmed too, so it's understandable, but it's annoying at the same time. We're just gonna trim this section here so I got plenty of room for belts. Okay. Um, let's go take them out. Pain in the butt. Pain in the butt. Well, they didn't have a base yet. They were forming one, but it wasn't f a full base yet, which is good. Okay. I kind of think I should build the rest of the wall before I do. Uh, let's go ahead and place this down. I'm so eager to place these miners down. That just gonna go ahead and do it. We're going for two red belts of iron, straight iron ore. Okay. 
Okay, plenty of miners, of course. Okay, yellow belt. Yellow belt. Another yellow belt and another yellow belt. One, two, three, four, five, six. Technically, that's three red belt. Um, we'll bring it down to two. that Have that there. This is a red belt. We have this here. Oops. And of course, a matter of yellow belt. Out of yellow belt already. That was quick. Let's bring this over to you. And then the same thing here. And then we're looking for a three to two. Oh, <laughs> I already had it. Okay. I'm going to have to go back and get some yellow belt. I'm not sure if I'm going to have enough. Okay. But then here is the two belts that I want to bring back here. How far does this go? Oh, okay. Okay. 
Okay. And then this one is pretty much done too. Okay. Let's do some belt finagling here. Share this wealth a little bit here. Same thing with you. Okay. And we'll come back and fix all this at a later time. But enough playing around with all this. Is there no trains coming out here? Oh, I see what's going on. Okay. Um, this can't empty. All right. So that means we need to put some production into the base. Uh, we're going to go ahead and proceed with some research here. I did do some back research for 9.17. Certain things that we've already had access to, I needed to do the research for. Like the science packs and the items for the rock control units for the rocket and such. Um, so let's just go ahead and research space science because why not? Um, that will go ahead and give some production to the base. Okay, and that means this should still be. We should be feeding iron in. Yes, we are. Uh, can we tell this to go to the next station? Yes, we can. Okay. Because <clears throat> that just cut off my, all my trains doing that. Perfect. We've fixed that temporarily at least. 
trying to get this figured out here. I need to get this going, this middle one here. It's a thousand. I'll walk away and do other things and come back. This will be dead. So, kind of just want to integrate it into Hue. What happens if we just do that? We integrate it into that. And then we kill this third one. Because that would make sense to do that. Okay. Get rid of that. Get rid of all this here. And then this can be red belt all the way to the station. Change you to red, change you to red, change you to red, just because. Okay. All right. So it's dark out now. So we'll just go ahead and try to stay in the light here checking this minefield is good okay back into the light just trying to kill some time here with that um, we can resupply for our miners here okay a long way for the iron ore to go but it's what is going to be okay so let's bring this down for power substations power that up and we'll do another one down here because we can you and you I'll have to do another one down here So, okay, and then that, that, and that. Put some lights. All right. We have this little bit snippet here. Does it call for another? No, it does not. I think we could just do that. Doesn't look pretty, but why not? Right. Fresh iron mines, iron ore mines being mined and being sent back to the train here. Excellent. can save that. 
I'm doing that. Okay. And now this transept should fill up. There we go. Okay, so we have that being okay now again. We have those two lines coming from the south. I think I'm going to save this one for a later rainy day. And the biters are encroaching. Okay. What I want to do though is I also want to set this miner up here and this up here and send that to the base. But I think that's going to have to be off camera. I'll go ahead and work on that because that is a lot of work and I know you guys are tired of seeing me do nothing but ore fixes. right? <laughs> Um, so yeah, we are on a roll. I'm going to go ahead and cut this episode a little short here. Actually, it's not short. It's on time. <laughs> um, but stay tuned for a mission critical uh, story arc or episode arc here again. Uh, next time, we're going to go ahead and work on some oil um, fixes one last time on camera, uh, starting with plastics. Uh, I think that's the only oil issue that we're having. Um, I don't see a problem here with batteries um, for accumulators and for lasers. I think I need to set up another one of these. So then I'm going to bring this down and set up a second box, a uh, second assembly machine for laser production. Um, I do want to get more plastic pr uh, pl production for the bus here. For later on when we're making those rocket parts. Um, and I think that's going to be pretty much it for the remaining fixes. I know there's an issue with the green circuits, but I think we're just going to roll with what we got. And these got 4,000 in each. Um, I might squeeze in another one of these up here. We'll see. Uh, that's a possibility. Um, but that's pretty much going to wrap this episode up. I want to thank you guys so much for joining me in this episode of Factorio. And if you haven't yet, please go ahead and consider giving me a like for this video. It greatly helps me and the channel out. And if you like what you see and you want to stay with everything Eddie Man, please go subscribe to the channel as well. Right now, thank you so much for joining me in this episode of Factorio. And like always, I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.